Good morning, everyone, on this Thursday morning. All week we've been talking about finding beauty in a crisis, using the acrostic of the word crisis. We talked about center on God's purpose, respond with courage, and today we want to talk about inviting others to give advice and support. Invite others to give advice and support. Now here is Esther thrown into the palace in a situation to save the Jewish race. And what I love about Esther is she was always open to the advice of others. She listened to her cousin Mordecai, and she also listened to the king's eunuch, and she would do what they told her to do. She was open to the advice of others. I wanna ask you a question today. How good are you at listening to the advice of others? Can I tell you, don't be afraid to listen to someone else's advice. I know throughout the course of me and James being the pastors here at New Life, had it not been for the advice and the wise counsel of those around us, I don't know what we would have done. There was situation after situation that because of wise advice from others, we didn't bail out. I remember at one point we were ready to bail out and we called my dad and dad's like, James, did God call you there? Well, if God called you there, then you stay. And can you imagine how hard that was for him because we was ready to pack up and come back to Arkansas. But no, he knew that this was where God called us and he gave us good advice. Our friends Bill and Beth Cheney gave us wise advice over and over again throughout situations that we come up against. And you have to stay open. Our council members have given us good advice. Our pastors give us good advice. Can I tell you, don't be afraid to get good advice. But more importantly, don't be afraid to listen to the good advice of others, to help you out of the middle of the crisis that you're in, to find the Christ, the beauty in the crisis that you're in. Because through their advice, you will think outside the box. It'll throw you into a different perspective. It'll help you think differently than what you're doing right now. So be wise this week and listen to the advice of others. Those that God put across your path to help you today, listen to them in Jesus' name.